the second step of the sun healing kit um, after detox is the tincture um, it is connected with the core center um, rather than general detox and specifically targets the gut and liver um, but also the gut microbiome the gut and liver are connected by nerve passage called the gut liver axis and uh, there's links saying now that uh, when the gut lining is damaged toxic substances and bacteria can leak into the liver um, because of the gut lining specifically uh, called leaky gut um, so it's important to heal the liver uh, because of this to help the gut and to heal the gut to help the liver alcohol and glyphosates can also lead to leaky gut um, and this gut permeability is now being linked to some liver diseases as well. Uh, liver cirrhosis is a condition that when not taken care of, um, the liver starts to deteriorate. It's uh, the liver at its worst state. Uh, the symptoms can include weight loss, weakness, low libido. Um, widespread death of liver cells can accompany progress of uh, fibrosis and the general destruction um, of the structure of the liver. Um, it usually develops after uh, long states of alcohol abuse, uh, drug abuse, and it's very predominant cause of death um, in North America and Europe. Uh, many people have it. Uh, poor diet, drugs, glyphosates uh, can further add damage to liver um, and pharmaceuticals. So this texture focuses on the liver gut. It has... Uh, lic licorice, dandelion root, milk, thistle, root, and top. There it is. Um, the dried herbs from the store are licorice and uh, fresh picked and dried dandelion root and milk thistle parts. Um, it's infused in alcohol, 40%, uh, 1 to 4 ratio, um, vodka, and the herbs uh, separately tinctured and put together. The licorice is a hepatic, uh, Glyceriza glabra. It's anti-hepatotoxic. Hepatotoxic. Um, it's very protecting, fighting against chronic cirrhosis and liver damage. It also stops DNA growth of viruses, which could help uh, hepatitis effect on liver as well. Um, it can heal Helicobacter pylori, which is a bad bacteria that is in the gut, so it promotes uh, the gut uh, health as well. Um, next is dandelion root, teraxecum, um, which is another strong hepatic and also relieves inflammation of the liver. Uh, it can be used for jaundice and in general um, liver detox and protecting. Uh, then there's milk thistle, which is uh, Silibum marania. Uh, I use the root and the aerial parts, including the seed. Um, it can reverse liver damage, protect against hepatotoxins, um, confirm to reverse liver diseases produced by alcohol. Uh, it can restore liver cells four times normal rate and in general allows liver and body to cope better with daily um, encounters of air, food, and water toxins around our environment. My tincture is also 100 milliliters and can be taking 15 mil milliliters daily, uh, preferably away from meals. Um, tincture should be taken for a few months uh, to start working. Uh, and the diet protocol to go along with the tincture um, is to support uh, gut bacteria and liver healing. So uh, fermented foods that heal gut, kimchi, sauerkraut, any probiotics, uh, yogurt or vegan yogurt, um, tempeh, fermented organic uh, soy, uh, tamari, miso, eliminating red meat could help and dairy for a little bit uh, as it could just cause some liver congestion. Um, at this point, no alcohol should be drinking besides a tincture as a client is in semi-detox mode already and it could affect uh, the protocol. Um, continue fresh fruit diet from detox, so fresh fruits, vegetables, preferably organic. Uh, wheat should be avoided since uh, it can also contribute to leaky gut uh, just for a period of healing time. 
plenty of clean water, fresh air, um, and when the gut microbiome is healed, it can lead to better mental clarity, uh, focus, and faster connection to the brain.